Welcome back to our Bluesy Water channel. Today we're going to do a little PowerPoint presentation on applications for Bluesy Water, with a special emphasis on our new application, the Bluesy Brain Tonic. So please enjoy. If you have any questions, please contact me, Andrew, at bluesywater.com. Thank you. So we here we have our how to use bluesy water. In this menu we have various applications, how to use the bluesy water, and our ingredients. So we recently added the brain tonic, which we're going to get to in a few minutes, but let's just go over some basics. First of all, a regular dose of bluesy water, if you're using clean water, you add a half a teaspoon of the concentrate to a gallon of water and you're ready to go. If you're treating sink water, you need to double the dose. Now, if you want to start intensifying the dose, you can basically increase up to a half a teaspoon of the concentrate, in other words, a gallon dosage, in two to four ounces of water. That's a very intensive dose. You are working; you can work up to that. And that's what well, we sell that in our Blue Z Boost product, by the way, which is on our website up here. Uh, Bluesy Boost, you can buy that ready-made. It's kind of like the five-hour energy drink, but way more profound. Anyhow, you can make your own intensive dosing and work up to this dosage. And you just need to, you know, monitor your detox reactions. It's very important to look at our uh, Maximize Your Bluesy Water Therapy. Anybody who's trying to do intensive detox, detox we absolutely recommend you get the vibration machine on our website or, or a more higher end machine. The one on our website is quite affordable to process detox. To, anytime you're trying to detox, it's, a, it's important to have this deep movement therapy. And just to uh, sidetrack just a little, on the comprehensive detox, we read this please we're using a comparison to washing clothes basically we're talking about how you would never wash clothes without engaging the agitator on the washing machine you would end up with a pool of filthy water and it's the same with the body anytime you're putting a very deep cleaning product into the body you want to turn on the agitator which in this case would be the vibration machine or a rebounder uh, vibration machine probably being more uh, intense okay so it's important to understand that that principle. So let's go back to the applications. So once again, if you're doing this intensive dosing, please purchase the vibration machine or, or use a high-end trampoline. Do not use inexpensive trampolines. Now we're going on to the bluesy bath before we get to the brain tonic. The bluesy bath, we have a whole dedicated uh, um, write-up on it. And you can look at the Maximize uh, program. But um, here's the bluesy bath. Let's go to that. So please read this. This is kind of like going to the best hot spring on the planet. You could do this at home. You need to purchase some type of bubbling system, whether it be a bubbling mat, which we talk about here. I have a video explaining all this. Or you can buy a little simple jet, uh, jet spot, single jet. Uh, I use both because the mat, you know, is a little more involved, and I like the jet. It's really easy. Boom, you put it on, you know, top of the tub. If you have a jacuzzi, you're ready to go. So it's important that one way or another you're bubbling the water to basically treat the water quickly, and otherwise you would have to wait too long to treat your bath water. This is extremely unwinding on the nervous system, and basically the best way to describe it is like going to one of the best hot springs on the planet so please check this out and check out the video alrighty so let's go back again and let's get to our featured part of the discussion today the brain tonic so if you read under why this bluesy water you're going to see an 80 page ebook describing how profound these minerals are in healing the body and Dr. Nohima calls them gene minerals they can actually a healed damaged DNA. Now many people are suffering with a lot of brain issues due to the EMF environment, cell towers, cell phones, and toxins, diet, you name it. Depending on how old you are, I'm just hearing many many more reports about brain compromise. And we do have a 
some couple of Dropbox folders that really go into depth with nutrition and various uh, protocols for the brain. In fact, I'm going to show you this real quick. So the brain involves the nervous system, the brain, the endocrine gland system, even you know the serotonin that we, people always talk about is um, most of the serotonin's in your guts. Now we're talking about digestive health. It's quite involved. And now we're talking also about the subconscious mind, the memory streaming through your brain from the mind. So we've that's why we absolutely encourage you to look at the trauma release program and start working on the subconscious and understand that relationship between the subconscious mind and the brain and the nervous system. This is one big dynamic. Then the detox program. It's very obvious that heavy metal, various intense toxins can do damage to the brain and the nervous system, the whole body. So we have the trauma release, the detox program, an overview program, which is just giving you, you know, the big picture. And then we have our various brain herbs. And we're also talking about sleep. It's very in-depth. So you can see we have a lot of um, supplements for the neurotransmitters. There's inflammation. Uh, fish oil is really good for inflammation. All the anti-inflammatories. Regulating the neurotransmitters such as dopamine, serotonin, and the, the uh, stress response, the GABA uh, neurotransmitter for stress. So there are, are, there's all sorts, you know, you can study this. We do have Dropbox folders that give you kind of the different supplements. And you can do a consult with us to assess, you know, if you're having issues with your brain, we want to do a deep assessment. Thyroid function is very important. The minerals are very important. There's something called brain magnesium, a really good mineral for the brain. Lithium orchate a natural mineral that actually helps with brain chemistry. We're not talking about the drug here. Hormones, depending on your age, can affect brain chemistry. Uh, then there are the fats, the fish oil, coconut oil, lecithin. CBD is a natural, non-psychoactive form of, comes from hemp or cannabis. has tremendous healing properties in terms of the stress, regulating the stress, kind of your shock absorbers of your nervous system. It's a primordial system called the endocannabinoid system. Alrighty, so... Just to show you, it's very deeply involved when it comes to the brain. So let's go back to the applications. Now, the bluesy brain tonic, basically, what we're doing here is we're, first of all, engaging all the key factors of the bluesy water. Number one, we're detoxifying the actual cellular brain system. So bluesy water is a profound detoxifier. Now, it's very important to understand how this works. What happens is if, you know, and I hate to use this analogy, if anybody knows, you know, people who snorted cocaine, why do you snort cocaine? Because it actually goes straight up into the brain vis-a-vis -vis the nasal membrane. Also, there are medications given to babies or people who don't want injections where these medications go through the nasal membrane. This dumps directly into the, the blood uh, system. Okay, so here's a, a video that's going to briefly show how doing a nasal spray gets into the brain. So here we go. Place the mad nasal gently but firmly against the nasal opening and briskly compress the syringe plunger. The medication exits the tip of the mad nasal as a fine atomized mist, resulting in broad coverage of the nasal mucosa with a thin layer of drug. The medication rapidly absorbs across the mucous membrane into the bloodstream, as well as directly into the cerebral spinal fluid of the brain, avoiding first pass metabolism. This achieves medication levels comparable to injections. Okay, so as you can see in that video, when you hit the nasal membrane, you get profound penetration into the brain and the entire body. So the brain tonic also is uh, based on a principle used in a therapy called photobiomodulation, which you can find in our trauma release program. In that therapy, they're actually sending near infrared light up at the nasal membrane, and that light actually goes directly into the brain, and that is used for healing brain trauma. So please take a look at our trauma release program and look up photobiomodulation. 
Okay, so now let's uh, take a look at the brain tonic and how to make it. You're going to mix one teaspoon of bluesy water into 10 ounces of water. You're going to need to make this a saline solution, so you add roughly three-eighths of a teaspoon of regular salt, not iodized, not sea salt, just regular plain old salt, and shake this very well. You want to mix the salt in. Now there's something called shungite, which is used for EMF. You can buy it on Amazon. It's very cheap. Just Google shungite stones or shungite water and how to make it. You can, for six, seven bucks, you can buy some of these stones, clean them off, and then put three, four stones in this 10 ounce jar. And this will add extra EMF protection. You could also add your favorite flower remedies or homeopathic remedies if you choose to, to do that. So now you need to mist this, this concentrate, this nasal uh, brain uh, cleaning concentrate, into a nasal spray bottle. So you can find those on Amazon, or you could buy the one you saw on a on the video that's called a nasal syringe. You just Google that, and you can buy those online. And um, we'll put a link below for where you can buy those. So now you want to get this mist liberally infused up the nose, and you also want to snort in. It's kind of like people who, seriously who snort in cocaine. I mean, they they snort in deeply to get it deep in the brain. It's the same principle. So when you do the misting, just snort in to get it up deep into the brain. And you want to saturate the nasal membrane. And you can really repeat this as often as needed. If you have a lot of brain trauma, a lot of brain issues, you know, you have to do this three, four, five times a day. So this is the basic principle. So once again, once those minerals get into the brain, they're going to help detox the brain and repair the brain cells. And also, if you add a little shungite, you might help with the EMF protection. The bluesy water minerals are, are very protective, and we're trying to essentially, since the brain is being bombarded with all kinds of weird frequencies, we're trying to help protect the brain from EMF, from toxins, and to actually heal the brain cells. So please try this brain tonic and, and then take a look at all these other applications, the bluesy bath, the intensive dosing, the regular dose. And if you have any questions, please contact me, Andrew at bluesywater.com. And we could also send you, uh, if, you know, if you have a lot of brain issues, this is one very good strategy, but it's real important to take a look at our brain charts and, and really do as much as possible because the brain is obviously interactive with the mind, the nervous system, the endocrine gland system, the digestive system. So you want to have a global, global approach. So appreciate it. Try this out and start studying up. There's a lot, a lot of work when it comes to healing the brain and there's a lot of offenders going on in today's world. Thank you. We'll talk to you again. Take care.